Hello everyone, this is Joaquin from uh, USA Sticks Boxes and Shields Resource Group and today uh, I want to do a little customization video um, for your Celador TV uh, Fusion. Right. We've gotten a lot of questions about um, where did the 3,000 channels go? Um, how can I get Dexter? Uh, different things, and I want to run you through uh, a few of the setup uh, items and show you how to do it. So, first of all, if you want to view your 3,000 TV channel guide, and I've already enabled it, but um, I can uh, I can definitely run you through that. So, your if you want to enable the 3,000 channels, go to your settings menu. Go to live TV. In live TV, you want to go over to enable and make sure that box is checked. When you check it, a message will come up saying that a PBR client has not been enabled. Um, you can just uh, follow that. It will take you, and I will show you where it will take you. Oops. It will take you here. Now you want to go scroll down to your PVR IPTV simple client and simply enable. Uh, I'll show you that the settings are already in there. So all you have to do is enable. And then you're going to want to reboot your system. So exit and come back in and uh, your PVR channels will load. Some people like it, some people don't. Um, I have still used these channels. Um, they still work and, and they're actually nice. So um, I continue to use them. Um, as for Dexter IPTV Pro, we have, um, done some, um, interesting, uh, installation to make sure that Dexter is there for you. I'm a Dexter user, and if you are, then you know, um, you know it's pretty good. Um, so go to your video add-ons. Find your Dexter. Um, bring up your context menu and go to add-on information and you'll want to configure your Dexter here. I've already configured mine so you're going to just enter your username and password and so forth and your Dexter will um, will definitely work. Um, another uh, little thing that I want to remind people of is that uh, you want, always want to check your available updates and uh, go down to the available updates it'll show you in this um, window if there are any available or if you need to and you can select which ones you do update um, so you don't run into the same kind of problems that URL URL resolver updates caused in the past um, one other thing that I get a lot of questions about and that is how can it get rid of this tab with the adult add-ons and I'm going to show you right now. It's relatively easy. Go to your system. Go to appearance. Go to the settings. And then go to submenu. Okay. Now you're going to scroll down till you find your add on submenu. And it's right here. So once you find it, you just click on here and the clear the menu option. If you clear the menu option, it'll be gone there. We'll get back out. We can go back to add-ons and it will no longer be there. Um, if you need to um, um, make sure that all of the things are gone, go to your video add-ons. And then from here, you can just go in and, and delete the... Uh, the add-ons that you find uh, offensive or you don't want your kids getting to them, those types of things. So um, definitely that's an option for you, and uh, it's relatively easy. So uh, this is just a quick little video to show you how to set up your EPG um, uh, with the 3,000 channels, um, where to go to set up your Dexter, 
and also how to disable that adult add-ons tab. So uh, this is Joaquin at Sticks, Boxes, and Shields, reminding you that the next war will be fought with Sticks, Boxes, and Shields. One love.